Welcome to the miniature martial art called arm wrestling. What is up, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to Savage Arm Wrestling. We all think of Devin Laird as a man who fires shots at people. His opponents, his, <laughs> his opponents' trainers. But every once in a while, Devin really drops us and hits us with some really deep crap. Let's get savage. On a recent Instagram post from Devin Laird, he's <laughs> telling Georgie that it's only six days left. But then he follows up with this amazing inspirational speech about the sport of arm wrestling and its evolution and a sense. Arm wrestling, okay? Sport of arm wrestling where an old man, 48 years old, 100 pounds less than his opponent, <laughs> whose forearm measurement is, uh, well, my opponent's forearm measurement is about the size of my leg. And somehow still, I'm the favorite. So much that he's not even supposed to win around. Ask yourself, how is this possible in a strength sport? Welcome to hand fighting. Welcome to the miniature martial art called arm wrestling. But this is a crazy truth in our sport. A sport that at one time everyone believed the biggest guy was the strongest guy. Back when Cleve Dean was arm wrestling. But an athlete who just happened to be a little bit more technical and understanding of the sport beat him by the name of John Brzezink. And then through there, history has repeated itself over and over and over again, where the smaller athlete with a more technical understanding of the sport came out victorious, a more well-rounded athlete in the sport. Will history repeat itself or will strength overcome. Devin Larratt experienced that the truth is in all sports technique will only go so far and then power takes over. You can only reach a certain cap with technique. Has Devin overcome it yet? Or will he hit another wall? It may not be with Georgie. And it's not Georgie I'm speaking about. Devin last met this wall when he faced Levon. Will Devin be ready to overcome that mountain of power with the level of skill and technique that he's accomplished during this time frame? We'll have to see. But first, we can't throw Georgie out. Georgie does have a hand, and Georgie's very skilled. But does Devin have all the technique required? I like to think so. You guys give me your opinion. Stay savage.